All right. Here we are. Well, hello. Snow. I forgot my name. You forgot your name. You're Snowman. snowman. And, uh, and DJ Squish. Yes. Hello. To, uh, well, live from Wisconsin. From a smoking garage. In Damn Wisconsin. right. Uh-huh. Uh, so I was almost going to attempt to open some new stuff that I grabbed at the Walmart. And, uh, and then DJ put the brakes on that and said I shouldn't. I shouldn't do that alone because that's like that's bad territory for me because it's new stuff. And <laughs> if it's if it's the only thing you get for the video, yeah, because it's usually like you're like ah that yeah and that that yeah. But the prism that you picked up, you'll be all right because you have old guys in there too. Oh yeah, old guys, old guys, yeah. Um, but DJ, I mean, shoot, you put together. Let's see, was it the two thousand two, the whole Chrome? Yes. I did the I did the tops chrome uh, set, but I kept in the uh, one Aaron Judge and a Goldschmidt, not doing a buyback because I wanted to have like the official, you know, of the full set. Right. And they're doing that again this year with chrome. What I was really happy about was the uh, Stadium Club because of the pictures. Okay. That well, one. Right. You put together. You put together the whole Stadium Club set too, right? Mm -hmm. So yeah. DJ knows his new stuff, so he has complete sets. That are within the last three and a half decades, which yes. mine are older. So, but I'm I'm also jumping into your realm too because I'm working on an '83 and an '84 set. Yeah. So, because I have an '82 set that I've had for you know almost two decades now, and I figured you know what the hell I want to do '83 and '84. Well, let's before we crack into these, let's then start. What else you're going to be doing? Well, you've got. I'm. I'm going about a week. Squish and Friends is going to be back at it. Okay. Uh, I got to be back on YouTube, man. Yeah. Uh, I miss it. I've. I've been talking to a lot of the. A lot of my local friends, and I'm just going to be bringing people on. Um, not only like live with me, but also over, you know, over the internet. And we're going to be opening stuff, talking, talking crap, talking cards. Good. Um, I just I want to learn about other people's collections, kind of like you're doing too. Um, being able to have conversations, but it's like conversations that over cards. Yeah. Squish and friends talking cards, but Good. yeah. Um, so everybody, look out for that new channel coming up when it's when it when it's up and going. I'll put a link um, to his videos in my description. And obviously, I'll be telling everybody wherever I can. Yeah. Uh, talk to the boys at COG. Talk to Maiden. Um, I'll be talking to well, pretty much anyone. Okay. And I, I can't tell you how much I appreciate you, Phil. You're helping out with that '84 and the '83 set, man. Yeah, of course. Like I said, yeah. in the uh, in the cavern over there, um, mm -hmm. there's a lot of uh, five thousand count boxes with comments from the early '80s and awesome. Yeah, and, yeah, of course. I, I lucked out with '83 because I had come across a couple lots where for no reason whatsoever like a wade boggs was in there yeah um i bought uh like just an 83 top slot of like i think it was like a thousand or 1200 cards and a sandberg happened to be in there cool. so i'm just i'm lucking out and i'm having a good time sorting them because it's what i do in my free time you know decompress yeah. a little bit sort some cards and enjoy it again yeah good um and then before we flip around and open these boxes um also, when your channel's up and running, that your main PC guys, if people want to do trades with you, especially since you're trying to put together full rainbows and, uh, and yeah, uh, Max Scherzer sets of? Max Scherzer and Buster Posey. Okay. So. I want to do thousand card collections of both players. And uh, so far, the rainbow I'm working on is Max Scherzer. It's a 2020 Prism rainbow. I've done pretty well on my own with that. Um, I had to kind of give up the 2020 top series one rainbow of Buster Posey because the short prints are non-existent out there. Um, he was a hell of a player. So I'm not the only one chasing that stuff. Oh yeah. Yeah. Like I said, a former coworker of mine, his PC guys were uh, Joe Morgan and Buster Posey. So, yeah. So, I mean, I'm up against good competition, but I think with Mad Max, I'm doing pretty well. I've got about 700 of 700 cards of his already. Cool. And I'm having a blast with that. Awesome. Oh, yeah. You got to, I mean, you helped me out with the PSA. You got to see a couple of Max Scherzers in there. 
<laughs> yeah, and then the one that I got that's sitting right here that I just... I don't want to talk about that. Okay. I can't part with it yet. <laughs> I don't want to talk about a gem. It, it's awesome that you got a gem 10 rookie, dude. That's I'm super happy about that. I mean, come on. A gem 10 shirt a rookie. Yeah. He looks so young in that card. So does Kershaw. Oh, my God. Well, a lot of these, too. I mean, who else is another one? that? But they, here, we'll flip it around. We'll show you again the... Uh, the Miggy Cabrera looks like he's like oh yeah on a little league doesn't team. even so look like this. him. We're gonna flip around and we're gonna yep. open some stuff. And I'll, uh, I'll be here for uh, more support. You are gonna whoops, that's not the right button. <laughs> <laughs> Whoopsie. I like the garage setup for me just because yes, I'm a smoker, but whatever. <laughs> I don't want YouTube to pull it, so I'll just keep the cigarettes out of view. Nice. Really, they would do that for. I don't know what they'll do. Um, I'm really like you. You know, you guys know me. I don't really like to follow rules. <laughs> no rules, just right, huh? Out back. Right, so, yeah. So I can duck so, like this. Upcoming, yes, everybody. I need to finish. I, I, I'm almost like sad to finish my series. There's day 15 right there of the uh, snowman rip, ready to go in the background. I will do it very soon. Um, that snowman rip has been pretty cool to watch, by the way. It's petered out some of the later days, but still, with how it started, I'm yeah. Thank you very much. It's 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 exciting. Here's the uh, the oh, young geez. fourteen year old looking Miggy. <laughs> oh my god! What year is that from? Uh, oh one. What's his real rookie? Was it like two thousand? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so this is like after his real like his Bowman rookie, but like I said, I don't think it has much value. But I wanted to get it graded in anyway. No, that that looks that looks cool. I like that. Shocked it got a nine, but um, yeah, so let's uh, what do you want to open first? You want to do the prism first and save the Bowman Platinum for uh, for the video? Uh, ah. COG, as always, we always say you have to be spending your Sunday nights with COG, COG's live stream 6 p.m. Pacific, 9 Eastern. And for everybody that thinks I haven't been on COG stream, I've been on every single one just hiding in the background for my own personal reasons. Yeah. I just, uh, I have been watching, uh, plus I work every Sunday, so I don't really want to jump into too much of a conversation with anybody and only have to, you know, kick somebody out or scan an ID at my <laughs> job at the church. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that worked. Yeah. Um, what else? Oh, yeah. So now I work Sunday nights, too. So I've only been in one in the last six weeks. And then I have to watch the replay on my off days. And I really miss it. And then the one Sunday night I was on there actually took the night off work to be there. That's the that's how well, that's... much must see TV COG is that you have to take off work to attend. So still, what did you say to start with? The prism. But I okay. needed to mention, too, the stands, the displays you made them were I mean, when you and I had talked, you had told me about them, and I had kind of an idea in my head, but to actually see how amazing they turned out, I mean, that's just something to be super proud of. Thank you. I appreciate yeah. that. They turned out really good, and those guys filled them up quick. They're already in the background, by the way. Have you, have you seen them? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, no, no, good. No, I saw good. them. They sent me a couple of pictures of uh, Rusty as he's inserting uh, Pete Rose cards in the, into his. So. Is it going to be all Pete Rose for that one? Uh, that one has a lot of Pete Rose and then, and a few other players. And then Maris... they need to put, they need to put pictures of those up on the site so that we can see that too, because okay. we, we can't see any of that stuff behind them. And, uh, you know, everybody's dying to see what these guys have in their PC. I mean, yeah. okay. Hank Aaron, Pete Rose, Roger Maris, Dale Murphy, whoop de doo I want to see what you, they, how many cards have those guys graded? Come on. Oh, uh, I'm going to say it's probably up to 500 now. Yeah, and I want to see what they've gotten a hold of. I've only gotten to see that Trout rookie once. I didn't know they had a Trout rookie. Uh, Snake made that trade at the Nashville show a uh, while back. He said they finally did it, and he 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 got a hold of it. He's had the Trout rookie. Wow. Um, mm -hmm. Speaking of Nashville show, if I have enough money after this next paycheck, I'm going to book a ticket, and I will be – at the mid-October Nashville show, so for real, you're gonna go out, dude. Yeah, good for you. Get out. Get you need to get out of Reno for a couple days. Yeah, so that's I'm looking forward to that. We're gonna have a blast. There's a trade night. They told me to bring you know like a briefcase with the you know handcuff to my wrist. Yeah, absolutely. Because TSA uh, won't mind that at all. 
<laughs> All right, we're opening. We're opening this. What is this? This is so everybody talks about. They like Prism. Da 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 da. I don't know much about it, but it was cheap okay. enough at the Walmart that I picked up 2023 Prism. I like it because there's some older guys in there, and then DJ is going to help with anybody that I do not recognize. And this year is different because they lost the rights to the current guys. Right. So 2023 Prism has not been opened. <laughs> Uh, by anybody else like it has been in the previous years so it gives us an opportunity to actually collect this this year yeah yeah those but you'll those have hall of there. famers legends yeah, super like old Vladdy, timers Vladdy daddy yep Vladdy daddy that carlton i love steve carlton cards yep you should have some uh pr silver prisms in there How do and I then tell? uh you'll it'll be shinier okay lefty and Wolf. then i actually never heard of him and then there should be your green or a blue Ooh. The one behind this. Who is that? That's Harry Ford. Did he didn't he used to make cars? <laughs> yeah, that's your that's your one per blaster. Very nice, Harry Ford. That was Henry Ford. Oh. And then there's your blue one per pack. More no. That's cool. Oh. Man, it's all like broken glassy. Cracked ice is what I like to call it. Oh, okay. Not broken They're, glassy. Broken <laughs> glassy. So what is this a rookie card? I guess it's not. Yeah, that's it true. is. I don't it see should the be. symbol. I don't see it. Who knows? It may not be allowed to use the RC symbol because oh, of that. Yeah. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. They can't have current players. So it's not a rookie card then. He's still in the minors. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Jake Madden. New guy. Don't know anything about him. Addison Barger. Nothing. A lot of guys I don't know. I've, I've opened a bunch of this. Glavin, there we go. Speaking That's a good picture of Glavin. Here. Look at that. Braves. Yeah. Al Newhauser. So that's one of the inserts. That should be yes. the old ball game yeah. insert. Yeah. Those have uh those have numbered variants as well. And then also you can get a silver prism version of them. This is a cool Bobby Door. Look at that. Yeah. That's your that's, blue per pack. That's cool. All right. It's not bad stuff. It's gonna be a good no, trip. it's not. I've opened about six or seven blasters of this, and if I get close enough, I'll just put the set together. But it's like you said, if you want to put a base set together, you also have to figure you're not getting all base cards because you have a blue one in every um, yeah. pack, and then a green one, and then the inserts. We got Nap Lajoie, Bobby Miller. Okay, hold on, time out. Is it Lajoie or Lajoie? I've only heard Lajoie. See, and for me, I've only heard Napoleon the Phantom Lajoie. Okay. You know the story about him in 33 Gaudi? Uh, yeah, where they didn't, uh, they, they were mean to the kids and they never made one. And then the only kids who got one were the parents wrote and were angry and said, where's the card? Yeah, it was, he was like the first send away. Yeah. Bobby so Miller. true 33 Gaudi sets have a, if they have the Phantom in it, it's insane. Yeah. So oh, Juan okay. Marichal right there. Yeah. Can't miss him. Oh, there you go. That's one of the cool ones. The the blueprint. Yeah. Johnny Bench. No, it's uh, Yvonne Rodriguez. Oh, Pudge. Pudge. Yeah. I have two Nolan Ryan's of those, and I love it. That's cool. Uh, Peyton Pallet. No, no, another guy that I just nope. Or or Palette, if we're if we're learning our yeah. French. We're fancy. Uh, Napoleon La Joie and a Palette. <laughs> if we're yeah, we're going. You, I still haven't seen the silver prism yet. It will say prism on the back of it as well. Okay. Yodi Cappy. It's inside. Cappy, yeah. <laughs> uh, Judd Fabian. Yes. Lou Bedreau. Hey, he was a Milwaukee Brave. Yeah. Marcelo Meyer, I've heard of him. Yeah, he's doing all right in the league. And Zach Nieto. He's doing okay as well. I believe he got, he's been bouncing up and down between the minors and the majors, which of course has been happening with everybody. Yeah. Justin Crawford. Yep. He's a player. Gordon Graceffo. I don't know. Nope. Not enough. With the pitchers, it's hard for me because they're constantly being rotated so much. Oh, yeah. Craig Vigio. Uh, and that's another good one. That's your rookie numbers, like your, your, uh, stat number or whatever it is, okay. your prospect number. Yuri Perez. And yeah, but scale. Thank you. Add uh, Al Bridwell. So 
Time Phil, what do you what do you think about the fact that you have a black and white picture of an, a legendary player on a cracked ice prism, which has only been around for you know a decade? I think that's really cool that you have a baseball card that shows a player from the you know 1900s on a pretty new type of chromium card. Yeah, well, I just uh, watched, and I didn't know this, so uh, I watched uh, Run Good Life open up some. Uh, Bowman Chrome, which just came out apparently, 2023, and he's saying that there are so I forgot what it's called, a Legends or something. It's the one where they're offering David Adams is offering a two hundred thousand dollar bounty for the Babe Ruth. Yeah, so it's considered a. Uh, a is that your garage door? Yep, that is absolutely my garage door because my brother is awesome. <laughs> one second here. I'm just going to remind him to keep it down. Um, I'm on the stream. Please go inside. I'm on the stream. Thank you. <laughs> How's the thing, David? Sure. Um, with, like, the Babe Ruth, it's considered his first Bowman, and then they're not going to make another. So... They're trying to make like value out of that. It's pretty crazy out of the uh, legends. So they're only going to do one Babe Ruth card and that's it? That's what they say. I mean, they could change their mind in 10 years and go, oh, we're putting them back in. But anyways, that's at least. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I don't at know how I feel about to, that. Uh, what he said when he's busting his uh, product today. Uh, yeah. Diego Cartaya. And he's riding the fire. Hack Wilson. That's cool. That is cool. A, another Marcel. This is the Marcel. I've had three Marcelo Myers now. That's getting kind of ridiculous. Okay. Oh, I was going to say, is, is this Goose's son? No, it is Goose Gossage. That's cool. I, I was going to say, yeah, Goose is in there. That's cool. Catfish right. is well, in that's, there. I didn't get any, uh, I don't, didn't see a refractor or a numbered. I uh, didn't see a numbered, but you should have a prism somewhere in there. It'll say prism. Oh, prism. Where would it yep, say? Yep, right there. Uh, right on the bottom, I think oh, it's right in the middle. So that I was, was going to say. Uh, so yeah, you'll have the prisms on the cracked ice, and then if it says silver, oh, it's a green prism one. On the 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 Henry Ford, <laughs> and another one. Okay, I got prisms in here that I didn't realize. Well, no, no, no. One should be a silver prism, though. One will be uh, like not that blue or the green. Okay. You should have had at least one silver prism in there. No, uh, that's not it. That's okay. Well, you know. there it is. There you are, bud. Or yeah, I told you. It's it's of course it's Marcelo Meyer. Hey, so. congratulations, Marcelo Meyer, and the blaster that apparently Phil found. <laughs> All right, now yeah. we're doing uh, 2022 Bowman. I like Bowman. You can hit some, you know, some cool rookies. And I got oh the stickers off of it, but it was on one of these seventeen dollar specials. So I got a hold yeah. of some. I got a hold of some mosaics. 2022 mosaic for seventeen bucks. Oh dang! Yeah, man. That's an expensive product, but I, I keep finding, like, cheap blasters. Cheap yeah. blasters. Yeah, and, and Bowman Platinum's, you know, pretty cool brand. I don't know if I really opened any last year, so. I think you did one one blaster. Oh, okay. I think. I think I yeah, I think you're right. Um, and I think I got a, uh, a Bobby Witt out of it, if I remember right. So, uh, Royce Lewis, rookie card. Very cool. Here's another. Uh, we got him in this box. Uh, Yuri Rosario. Okay, so I guess he's playing for San Diego, huh? Yeah, it's a. Uh, is that a, is that who I think it is on the next card? <laughs> yeah. Who who is it? It's uh, Wonder Wonder. Yeah, it's the minor leaguer. I mean, no. Hey, who is that? Tyler McGill. McGill. No, yep. it looked like somebody else. I didn't see the rookie card logo though. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, it's a, it has a rookie card logo on it. Can you believe, though, that Mad Max got traded to Texas? Um, I think what, I mean... he get, Max got quoted as saying he never thought he was going to leave the Mets, which meant he was going to retire as a Met. Right, but I guess they're kind of, you know, they're having a great year just like the Yankees, so they're kind of fire-sailing it. Yeah, no, the Mets have completely crapped the bed. Yeah. Alec Bohm. He's dead. He's swinging now, which is good. Juan Yepes, rookie. Middle of the road. Alejandro PA. Ooh. 
What's that? What I get? It's a Charlie Blackman, so it's not a mm -hmm. record, but it's a it's a something. Uh, yeah, you would know better on, than I would on that guy. It's well, a nice no, no, little sparkle. It's, uh, the, the color of it, it's it's not numbered, but it's a sparkly shiny. I love sparkly shinies, just like that uh, glassy cracked. Yeah, and then, and then Cabrian Hayes. Cabrian Hayes turned out to be better than O'Neill Cruz because O'Neill got hurt. Well, yeah, and he after, you know. Half, didn't he? Something like that. I mean, for a guy that that's much of a mutant to get hurt like that pissed me off because he was. One of your nicknames, the Predator. Come on, Colson what you got there? Memory. Oh, these are the whatever the elementals or whatever, right? Oh, the the bubbly cards. Yeah. Ooh, Cal Raleigh rookie. There you go. That's a good one. Yeah, it is. That's cool. Did you see that Kalanick got sent back down to the uh, minors for a while? No, I thought he was actually coming around this year. He was. He got sent down to the minors for a little bit, and I think they brought him back just because. But he might be one that I have to start PCing as well, just because all my other PC guys are, you know, retired now. I figure <laughs> with a guy that, well, he's he's from 20 minutes down the road from okay. me. He's okay. from Waukesha, Wisconsin. Ooh, this this hurts my eyes. That looks pretty, That's, though. Oh, I just no, the corner. It's completely destroyed. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's not a rookie. I can't even read the name. Who is it? Come on. Oslevis Basabi. Oh, yeah. One of those. Yeah, I, of course. C.J. Abrams. I heard of him. Mm-hmm. And Jazz Chisholm. Junior. Oh. The fourth. That's right. <laughs> if Tops right. ever, if Tops ever does a Spencer 2021 Rush. Tops version ever again, I will stop buying baseball cards from Tops. What's that? It happened? was so the 2021 tops, how hard it was to read the names on those cards. Oh yeah. Jeez. Uh, made me feel old fast. Yeah. Spencer. Spencer the Torque. Excellent. Velotti. Oh, I can't see that name. Doug Nikhazy. And I'll stand the judge. All stand. All right. Not all stand. <laughs> Luckily, I've only been Everybody in get up. It's Aaron. Once. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> all stand the judge. <laughs> Eloy Matt Olson. <laughs> I'm getting this like confused church like you're in New York right now. You're not dressed like a judge, you're dressed like a priest because you're just really good. I'll stand, it's Aaron. Like what the what? <laughs> Phil. No. It's all right. I haven't I haven't watched enough law and order exactly. Oh. Uh Joe Adele, I remember when everybody's high on this guy. What happened? Yeah, I kind of got rid of my I gave away all my Joe Adele cards. Uh, Dayton Hill. Yep. What's this? Corbin Carroll. Wait a minute. That's a, save that. Yeah. That's, One of the fastest players in the league, literally. I've heard of him. Yeah. And then he's, Cattell Marte. Um, side note, too, is that uh, a big thing that I did and will still do is give away cards. Because if it's not something that I'm going to collect right away off the bat or if it's not a set I'm putting together and someone else can enjoy it more than me, yeah, cool. I'll be giving it away. So um, I'm going to be figuring something out where um, every video I'm, I want to give something away just to have some fun. Shit, that's awesome. Yeah. Cool. Well, there's that box and that box. Nothing, Nothing too crazy, but. No, it's fun. Fun to that open, fun to talk. Fun to open and fun to talk. You just hit it on. So, head. what were what? The, yeah, all the all stand and the glass leash cracked and yeah, uh huh. So this is essentially what I I want my channel to be is enjoying that opening up cards with somebody that you're friends with. Um, what what are you doing over there? You're breaking stuff. No, I, I I flipped. I switched stands. See, this one was at a different angle. Uh, well, you also know what you card. didn't do. You didn't put a single card on a stand again. Again, but it's all right. I promise I will in day fifteen. So, <laughs> but because if I use this stand for this camera, you're gonna be looking at my nostrils. But then when I hit it, thank again, God. 
center pocket of the pool table here. So oh well, well congratulations, mark it down. Yeah. Did, did you want to see what was on the front of this guy? Oh, yeah, I've been wearing yeah, it. Your, your hat. Yeah, so all right, I'm a minor big minor league, league baseball team. theme night. Okay. This is a virus hat, COVID virus. Go wearing go a mask. To, go to your go to your left. There you go. No, nope, you're on the left. There you go. <laughs> Describe it. What's happening there? It's a uh, a virus wearing a mask, holding two uh, thermometers or syringes as baseball bats. What did what did they have like uh, vaccines at a minor league night or something? I'm sure they did. Yeah, I don't even remember the team name, but. It was. I just go if if you guys want to find the best looking hats ever. I just bought a hat that is like a club sandwich with eyes, and that apparently was a theme night. And then there's another one I want to get a hold of once they re-release it. It's a piece of sushi hitting wasabi with a bat. That yeah. was that. That's the logo. Yep. Yeah. Let me, yep. Safety cone with eyes. Don't know why, but yep, that's a hat. Cool. Yeah, me and a buddy around here are just hat nuts, and yeah, ah. it's gonna it's gonna get worse before it gets better. Okay. Yeah. I I thank you very much, Phil. Yeah, I, I really fun. do. Thank you. I'll, um, I mean, the biggest accomplishment too was all happened behind the scenes before we even recorded. <laughs> yeah, figuring this out quick. Going, oh yeah, I'm gonna try Streamyard, and then and then actually figuring it out, and and knowing how to send an invite, and then. But then I had to quickly uh, text uh, Snake at COG and say, we did a test video. <laughs> we might it. have broke the internet. <laughs> Where did it say? Where? And then he told me. So thank you. Yeah, no, I, I, you did a hell of a job. Thank you, Snake. Yes. <laughs> but no, I, I was impressed. You fired that out real quick. You're just like, here's invites. Here's this. Let's do this. Ha ha. <laughs> well, you know, once a year I can figure stuff out. The rest figure of it, it out. Yeah. Back to... Uh, Duct tape and uh, concrete. So, zip strips. Zip strips are my friend. Okay. Oh yeah, I, I I use them everywhere. Just put stuff together. You want to hold that together? Two zip strips done. Okay, I will look into that. That work. Yeah. Those right. are, the, the electrical cable ties. You know what I'm talking about. You call them zip strips. Okay, just don't use them at work. Why not? Um, <laughs> not work for human dirt. consumption. All right, well, let's let's wrap up here. Thank you. Have a good night. Ta ta, and, and 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 go baseball cards. <laughs> yes, go baseball cards.